Naruto, 10 anime villains who would join forces with Madara. Madara Uchiha is one of the most notorious villains in the Naruto canon, and these fellow anime villains would happily ally themselves with him. Over the course of Naruto, many villains have come and gone, but one that seems to have been lurking and manipulating people and events from the shadows for a long time, Madara Uchiha. Madara was one of the co-founders of the Hidden Leaf Village, and the village's first rogue ninja. He's the type of villain who doesn't care what he has to do or what has to be sacrificed in order to achieve his goals. Madara is persuasive, cunning, bloodthirsty, and able to influence and manipulate people to join him. There are many villains beyond the world of Naruto who would join forces with Madara. 10. Yamori is cunning and enjoys torturing his victims Tokyo Ghoul. Yamori, or Yakumo Omori, is a sadistic ghoul from the 13th Ward and one of the major antagonists of Tokyo Ghoul. He received his nickname, Jason, because he's so fond of torture. Much like Madara, Yamori is cunning and traitorous, willing to do whatever it takes to get his way. He has no problem with mass murders treason, or terrorism, and thrives on killing people. Yamori is not only physically strong, but he also possesses many supernatural powers that would make him an incredible asset to Madara's team. 9. Noitora Gilga has an insatiable bloodlust and sadistic nature Bleach. Noitora Gilga is a particularly lecherous character from Bleach. He's crude, sadistic, and enjoys belittling the people around him. Gilga enjoys fighting but only wants to fight those he deems strong, as weaklings are unworthy. One thing that sets him apart from others in the series is his near insatiable bloodlust and his incredibly vicious nature. He craves a good fight, so much so that he indebts himself to Aizen to exceed his limits. With how Madara likes to manipulate people, he'd enjoy having Gilga on his team. 8. Don Krieg is a notoriously dishonest and cruel pirate without honor one piece. Don Krieg is an infamous pirate of East Blue and the captain of the Krieg Pirates who serves as a primary antagonist in One Piece. Like most villainous pirates, he has no sense of honor and is incredibly cruel, dishonest, and unforgiving. He's also a weapons master and believes that his weapons can overcome anything. If they can't, then he's more than okay resorting to underhanded methods to win. Much like Madara, he's bloodthirsty and will sacrifice anything to get his way. 7. The Major loves war and will do everything possible to incite conflict Helsing. Montana Max, or the Major, is the main antagonist in Helsing. As the commander of the Millennium Organization, he seeks to push the world into an endless war. The Major loves war and believes that there's nothing more thrilling than trying to win. He doesn't care how many lives are lost or the reason behind it. So long as there's a war. He's sinister and prideful, but in spite of this, he's intelligent and has a certain immortal calmness to him that allows him to execute his plans. This makes him a great tactician. 6. Daryl Yen is a two-faced villain who can be playful yet sadistic guilty crown. Daryl Yen goes by many names and none of them are good. The Butcher, or Kill Him All Daryl, is one of the main antagonists in Guilty Crown. He's an interesting villain with two sides to him, one side is playful while the other is sadistic. As he has a profound phobia of germs. He fights for the total annihilation of everyone he's deemed to be infected. He has no problem with mass murder or killing innocent people. He even went so far as to kill his own father. 5. Frisia is highly intelligent and can manipulate people into doing his bidding Dragon Ball Z. Frisia is one of the main antagonists in Dragon Ball Z and makes reappearances in many of the other sagas. He is one of the cruelest and most evil villains in the entire franchise. He's highly intelligent and capable of manipulating people to do his bidding. 
while also capable of reasoning with people. He enjoys destruction too much for that to happen. He has no qualms about mass murder and thrives on death, blood, and causing others pain. 4. Vicious is a ruthless and bloodthirsty mercenary who loves to win Cowboy Bebop. Vicious is the leader of the Red Dragon Crime Syndicate and the main antagonist in Cowboy Bebop. As he's a mercenary, he's cold, ruthless, and calculating. Not only that, but he's cunning, manipulative, and fueled by a desire for vengeance. He's also highly intelligent and an excellent swordsman who often uses his skills to torture and kill people. Vicious is always willing to do whatever it takes to get what he wants, even if he has to stab someone in the back to get it. 3. Yami Bakura is a thieving evil spirit Yu-Gi-Oh! Yami Bakura, also known by numerous aliases, is the main antagonist in the original Yu-Gi-Oh! anime series. He is, in fact, an evil spirit from the Millennium Ring who possessed his poor host, Bakura Ryu. Due to his heritage, Yami is now a sadistic thief who often crosses the line to get what he wants. He's arrogant and bloodthirsty, always with a scheme up his sleeve, and would regularly possess and manipulate his host to torment people. Yami was capable of torturing and brainwashing people and more than okay with murder. 2. Jericho loves to fight and often gives in to his killer instinct soul leader. Jericho is a deranged demon weapon with a foul mouth. He serves Arachne Gorgon, the eldest of the Gorgon sisters who created the magic weapons. Jericho is an excellent enchanter and golem maker and can even make them during combat. He's an incredible fighter with killer instincts. He's also rude, unkind, and loves nothing better than a fight often giving in to his destructive and bloody urges. Jericho loves to kill, and he even swapped his mind with children so that he could live over 30 lifetimes. 1. Stain is a murderer with a uniquely bloody moral code My Hero Academia. Kaizo Makaguro, also known as Hero Killer, Stain, is one of the most memorable villains in My Hero Academia. Notorious for killing many pro heroes. He was previously a vigilante and used his abilities to be a hero who didn't obey the law. Cold, merciless, and unforgiving, especially when it comes to his goal of cleansing the world of false heroes. Stain loves to kill but doesn't like to kill needlessly. His blood related quirk complements his violent deeds. He also has a strong set of very specific morals and beliefs and won't budge from them.